How are you doing? Carl from Advanced Safety, just reviewing four different types of high-vis jackets today. I'm not getting too much into the benefits of one brand or one jacket over another. I'm going to talk about this jacket, but I suppose this is let's say the top quality jacket that we have here today. Um, it's more, I just want to focus more about the waterproofness and the functionality of the jacket as opposed to, you know, why this jacket is great over another, but I suppose this is one of the top, top end jackets that we have. It's a jacket from Sion. They're probably probably are the biggest uh, rainwear manufacturer, one of the longest established definitely rain manufacturers in, in Europe. Or they, they have a base here in Ireland, we've been dealing with them for a number of years. So this jacket is their Windsor jacket. This is a three layer jacket. So there's three layers of fabric protecting you from the rain on the outside. So this jacket, I've asked for the stuff from Sion a number of times, I haven't been given it. Um, my guess is this jacket is somewhere between a 10 and 20,000 millimeter waterproofness jacket. And if I was to sort of guess, I would say probably in the higher segment more than the lower segment. So it's a very good three layer waterproof breathable jacket. And this was what Sion would claim to be their equivalent of Gore-Tex, a Gore-Tex type waterproof jacket that we all would know and have heard of in the past. So as I said, we'd, I'd estimate a waterproofness of 10, 20,000 millimeter waterproofness with this jacket. Okay, so just probably just to take a quick look through some of the features and benefits of the jacket without getting too much into it, because again, it's not about trying to promote your jacket. So again, this is a, is a, it's a, it's a three layer membrane jacket. So it has good waterproofness. It'll have good breathability because of the fabrics that's used in it. One of those layers will be polyurethane and outer layer is probably polyester and there's a, there's a mid layer, I'm not sure of, what, of what, it, what it is. But you can see it's quite a fashionable jacket. They've put a lot of color and a lot of cuts and flakes into it. Again, the seams will be taped. Just a, 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 just a one thing I find out of all the jackets, of the four jackets that I've worn uh, this afternoon, the fabric of this is lovely. It, it, it feels like a cloth, uh, it feels soft and it feels very pliable and it feels comfortable on. And it's quite a good fit as well. Now, um, again, I suppose it's got the, you know, the tape overs on the, on the seams, double storm cuff, internal pocket, always handy, hood in the collar, and this particular jacket as well takes a, a, a zip in, inner fleece or things like that. Um, you can see there it's got an internal pocket, I think, for your hood if you want to put it into it. We'll just try and take a look. Again, this jacket comes as an unlined jacket. And you can see it quite clearly here, even though it is a three layer jacket as we spoke about. Just wanna see, can I get at it? Oh, I can, brilliant, there's a zip on it. So it is a three layer jacket. But again, you know, we're back to the same old technology of uh, taped seams. Now, one thing I do notice on this jacket, this is an expensive jacket, you know, it's, it's definitely plus 100 euros, it's probably 100 to 150 euro jacket. Uh, when you look at the seams, they're taped. The quality of the tape is so much heavier than the real bottom end jacket. So that's what you'd expect. You know, there's a better quality seams. And, you know, the seams are really where the jacket's going to give up first. So there's a very good quality seams in here. Uh, again, the, there's a, I, I imagine it to be a polyurethane coat, coating here as well. And the mid layer, I'm not sure what it is. Or maybe this counts as a layer. I'm not sure exactly, to be honest, because I suppose some of these manufacturers will keep their technology quite close and they don't want to reveal too much because their competitors are always watching. But again, I've sold this jacket a num to a number of customers all around Ireland. And, you know, even just one company, a roofing company, and they said, look, this jacket, you know, it's, it's an all day rainwear jacket. And uh, definitely, I suppose, for someone who is standing in the rain for eight hours, this is, uh, I suppose, the type of jacket to consider.